miss those looks very often. Well, we just missed it, man. Here's Bayless. Threw it on the triple. Bayless has got five Time out. And he came Start off it. that screen, and the D just didn't get over the top of it. Yep, weren't there in time enough to challenge Greg, and when that's the case, you can mark those up for him. New York calls the timeout. And what a double double machine. Why am I? I'm not even a. Oh my god. I'm not even a shooting guard, and he's not being a shooting guard. Like what? Continuing to evolve. For the Knicks, Jared Williams checked in for Przingis, and it's a follow in for Grant. Look at that. And Milwaukee that. also making a switch. Plumlee is checked in for Monroe. Can Derek shoot? Three, a rebound by the Bucks. Oh, uh, Greg, the thing about Monroe, we knew he was a prolific scorer and a rebounder when he was a five-star recruit out of high school. So, so Clark, this is nothing new for him. I think what you see, Kevin, is the added muscle coming into play and benefiting. He's just an average athlete, but being stronger makes him more effective. Bucks trail by 18. And Bayless kicks to Middleton. Parker up top. He feeds it to Antetokounmpo. Can't get it to go. Good D by Love. Knicks have gone 6 and 9 from the floor here in the second half. They've got to be able to. That's how he makes his presence. One-handed dunk, though. That one-handed dunk, though, people. Sure, guys, as important as it is to go out and compete. Boom! Let's not forget the entertainment element of this game. What an unreal Ah, dang it. There's too many people around me. For that sweet Kia slam cam replay. Floats one up. But he doesn't get it. You got to give him a lot of credit for the job they've done on the backboard. They've done a lot of things well today. We're gonna follow really doing some pick and roll. Or pick and roll. <laughs> pick and roll. And now we'll get perspective here on how the hustle game has been going. Time out. Time out. Seen them make the, the Bucks suck. From a defensive standpoint, closing out airspace and sending shots back. They haven't wasted time getting the ball up the court tonight either, and it's resulted in a lot of fast break points. Now a timeout called by Milwaukee. Yeah, none too pleased with the play of his team. And, and you know what? They just need to get things sorted out. Yeah, you know, there's not a coach around Where's who would be happy with oh, the way these guys have kind of rolled over during this run. And a new group in for the Knicks. Lopez, he's checked in for Smooth. Porzingis comes in for Derek Williams. Anthony's checked in for Aaron Aflala. And it's Grant in for Jose Calderon. And then for Milwaukee. John Henson's checked in for Jabari Parker. And it's made really? for Chris Really? Really? Come on now, people. Let's be real about this. Why this man got gray hair? You know, at first glance, you wouldn't think that he'd be comfortable in that particular situation. Looking like the old man from Medea. He didn't look like he was out of his element Grandpa right Joe. The Bucks shooting their first free throw attempt on the night. And guys, when you look at OJ, that was a funny move. Over the past few years, nothing really stands out. Oh, lit. What are you doing? In clutch moments, and he can seem like the most dangerous guy on the floor. A scary deep range shooter who loves to. Boom! Sit down. 105 left in the third. And Bayless kicks to Honda Takumba. Back in off the glass. On to Takumbo's got his third bucket of the night. They're not as aggressive from the outside here. But maybe they should think about stretching the defense a little bit, like they did in the first half. I mean, stretching the defense makes it easier to score inside, too. Grant gets a wide open look. Alright, I'm gonna stop shooting with him. And we just got blocked. We got it back. Look, Carmelo get Wow. Really? Really, OJ? Really? Position there. Yeah, and, and I, I like this call because you want the refs in that situation. If there's any doubt, err on the side of giving the benefit of the doubt to the Ooh. offensive player. That should have been a block, and it worked. How many feet was that shot? My here. God. Carter Williams has checked in. He dishes it to Henson. Come on, come on, come on. Outside, out of the Kumbo. Over to the wing. Carter Williams against Grant. Carter Williams can't get it to go. Really, Mello? Really? From deep. And it would have counted had it fallen. Ladies and gentlemen, your city And we're getting underway here in the fourth quarter. The scoreboard tells the story in this matchup. But we'll 
see how much things change up here. The Knicks leading by 22. They got Smooth. Porzingis is out there with Smooth. Then there's And it's Anthony in at the two guard spot. That's the five for New York right now. And that's another assist. Definitely my boy open. Definitely him open. On how to share the ball. And I love the mentality that they've had. If a shot isn't wow. there, they're not forcing okay. it. They're moving well, you keep on believing that, man. You were shooting one. for hope anyway. Here's love. He makes his own shot. But I still get it. I still get it, people. I still get it. He is really starting to be exposed here. How many layups have they gotten today? Come on. To the wing right side. Hunter Williams dishes the puck. Dirty, dirty, dirty. It's all in by That's right. Not only is their lead big, but their advantage on the board is doing? huge too. They've what are you doing? Aggressive, plain oh. and simple, oh. them oh. uh, no. for every loose ball. The buck shooting the ball at 42%. Also, people, uh, please subscribe to our channel. Please also Hunter leave a like and a comment. Really does help our channel out right when you do that. Offline with his three. New York's gone seven of fifteen from three point range tonight. They're not afraid of that shot. Anthony drives in. Ah, from 14 how did I miss that? No breathing room at all to take that shot. They really want to find that igniter here. Yeah, that's right. The, Kevin, the offense has basically been running in place. They got to get going. And so yeah. A trip to Push the his ass to the ground. To the ground. And Greg Monroe really has had a good young career. Despite playing out of position for, for much of it, he has the size and skill set of an agile center but was made to play power forward in Detroit once they drafted Andre Drummond and that took some getting used to Jared Bayless has checked in for Carter Williams and he sinks the Dang. second really dude you gotta call another time out oh, my god what kind of coach we got here the long range jumper teams are now asking out of that position in this day and age in the NBA more teams want that stretch power forward. He's um, not super athletic. Uh, where he does his greatest damage is in the painted area. There's still value in that. Looking at who's out there now for the Knicks. Kyle O'Quinn. Nice, nice, nice. Williams comes in for Persingas. And it's a flawless in for Carmelo Anthony. Parker sets the screen for Hunter Kumbo. Kicks to Middleton. Really? Another foul? Another foul. And, and boy, how good was Chris Middleton last season? He was always a deep shooter who could stretch the floor. He hits the weight room in the offseason and became a much stronger defender. I wonder if we cannot foul, guys. Like, that'd be awesome. A different look for Milwaukee. Johnny O'Brien comes in for Jabari Parker. And it's Vaughn in for Giannis Antetokounmpo. Feeds to Williams. He tries for Shoot for hope. Rebound by Greg Monroe. <laughs> Dang it. Monroe's got eight rebounds in this game. And for Chris Middleton last season, he went up in points, assists, rebounds, but went down in turnovers. Boy, what an improvement for this young man. A late bloomer. I liked him when he was at Texas. Really? He's still growing into his body, playing with great confidence, and he can spray that thing from three. I like his promise. Calderon gets to O'Quinn. On the wing, Williams. Love right side. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. Middleton. It's three on three on the fast break. Here's Bayless. Oh, my God, people. For Bayless, it was his sixth team in seven years last season. A good utility combo guard to have. He can score, he can make plays for others. He's really defined his role in this league. It's been a nice game for Bayless. He has eight points, and he's added a steal to his stat line also. Oh you my know, God. The number is not huge, but he has been doing some valuable defensive work for them. Zinkis, he's checked in for New York. Milwaukee also making some changes. Henson comes in for Johnny O'Brien. And under Takumbo. Come on, man. Ball. How you missed that? Talking about Jared Baylor, some thought he would be a star when he first entered the NBA. And uh, what am I doing? What am I doing? But inconsistency and internal to get the lid out of course yeah, of course is, no is one's at the paint to points. help you, you need a lift you, you need a smart offensively you, you go see jerry and a follow kicks to love 
Gets to the corner and buries it. Club's got 22 points. Boy, guys, they've shown some great passing on their last few trips down the floor. Excellent. Four straight passes leading to scores. Great team play. And it's blocked by O'Quinn. Physically, there's no doubt they've been the stronger team. What are you doing? Tells you all you need to know. Yeah, not to mention what it says on the scoreboard. They're really pushing them around. Straight bully ball. Jensen with the screen. Bayless dishes to Monroe. And O'Quinn sets it down. And it's out of bounds. The Bucks able to retain possession here. And the Bucks making a change here. Parker's checked in. In for the Bucks. Down to five on the shot clock. On Delta Kumbo, and the Bucks miss again. Yeah, credit the D there. Got his hands up and made sure he wasn't comfortable on the release. Sure did. Stayed real snug on him and didn't allow him the space he needed to get a good shot off. A shot nice. O'Quinn's got four points in the quarter. And as they continue to just dominate this game, you have to wonder how much can they win by. Well, it's on the verge of getting guys. You already know who won. <laughs> it's so easy to tell. In part because the defense has been about as good as the offense, and both have been really good. It's deflected. Well, guys, this was never really a contest. Just a total obliteration, if you will. You can say really, say, really. Now for New York. Not only did they shoot the ball better, but they had more assists. Well, the ball movement was good. The player movement was excellent, and you only get assists. Ah, it don't out. matter. We're still going to win. Mark their fourth win on the year. Actually, their fifth win on the year. And as we get set to put this one to bed, a one-sided season series thus far. They've won two straight. Yep, but two more to go before the end of the season, and they'll obviously be very confident heading into those two games. And beyond the actual result of this game, fans are going to look back and, and see this was just a monstrous performance for Love. A big part of their success was his ability to keep the ball moving, finding guys when they would flash open. What about he hit it? He hit it. Careless oh, that's turnover. Cool. You've got to be smarter in those exchanges. So for the Knicks, Derek Williams, he checked in for Pazingas. Thomas comes in for Smooth, and it's Grant in for Jose Calderon. Milwaukee, no good that time either. Shot clock and game clock separated by less than six seconds. O'Quinn with it. Now guarded by Plumley. Here's Grant. He still can't no shoot. <laughs> he still can't shoot. Now here's Ennis. He's covered by Grant. To the inside. Plumley. The shot is off. Good D by Williams. So no problem for All right, we won, guys. Please like, subscribe, and leave a comment to this video. In every way, the all cylinders go. No question about that. And once they pulled away, they didn't let up. Jose, congratulations on the win here tonight. How important was winning this game following your last loss to try to reestablish some momentum? Well, I think we played better. I think we're getting confidence. I know it was a bad loss, but we know what we have to do to win games. Uh, we've got to be really concentrated. Uh, that's what we do. Everybody got to be on the same page. Keep helping each other. Uh, that's how a team win games. Thank you so much. Back to you guys at the table. All right, Doris, thank you. And that'll do it, folks. For Greg Anthony, Doris Burke, Clark Kellogg, and the rest of our terrific 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. Now it's time to head back to the studio with Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, and Kenny Smith. The 2K Sports Post Game Show. Hello again, everybody. Ernie Johnson joined by Shaq and Kenny the Jet. Now let's take this opportunity to check out our Jordan player of the game. He came out of the locker room at halftime with some nice shooting, going three for three to start the third quarter. I can't imagine the player having a better night from the field than he had tonight. His shooting percentage was off the chart. He used every trick in the book to get those high percentage shots. He shot from every direction, and there was a little bit of luck here and there, 